Welcome to Skinny TV on YouTube once again. Let's take the latest news coming in from the camp of Ghana. Black Galaxies. Yes, the team will play the last friendly game before the champ tournament against Mozambique. Mozambique is also in some hot form. They won their last game four goals to nil. I have the exclusive latest news for you on this channel. Then after that, we will talk about other latest news coming in from the camp of Tariq Lamte. He has also reacted to Brighton and Hove Albion super win over the weekend. We will talk about him here on this channel. Then Manchester United fans are also excited over Mohamed Kudu's absence in the Ayas team. Why were they excited? Let's talk about the details on this channel. Before we delve into it, make sure you like the video first. Kindly like the video after that. Make you smash on the subscribe button. Put on the bell for more updates on this channel. Also, don't forget to leave your comments in the comment section. I'll be giving shout outs to those who commented in the last video. So if you join me, don't forget to leave your comments, like the video, and also you can share it as well. Let's delve into it. Ghana versus Mozambique is up next. And let's talk about it yes ghana black galaxies will play in the upcoming champ tournament in algeria and you know the team has been preparing very 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 well before the tournament ghana has played a lot of friendly games we started in ghana here played our first friendly game against a crowd of folk one of the top sides in the ghana premier league beating them by two goals to one the team continued to beat legon cities by two goals to no after that they actually traveled to egypt where ghana beat egypt under 20 by two goals to now we continue to beat el ali by three goals to one then the team played their last friendly game before the one which is going to happen tomorrow which was against algeria which ended goalless in that particular game so the team is set to play our last friendly game before the champ tournament begins tomorrow against mozambique and um we are yet to know the actual time that the match will be played but just stick and stay with me you know definitely i'll be bringing you the time the venue and everything um as it stands now we may play the game at the Nelson mandela stadium where we played against um the algeria side but still just be with me i'll bring you the details on this channel so tomorrow that is when the game will happen that's january 10 2023 against mozambique mozambique on the other hand is coming into the game with some good form after yesterday they beat um paradu ac reserve side by four goals to nil mozambique team which has been in algeria since last weekend to prepare for the african nations championship which is the chan um they played a friendly match yesterday against the reserve of paradu ac after having lost the first preparation match two days ago at Ruba Stadium in Algiers, the team actually um, continued to win the game yesterday. They lost their first game against Malodia of Algiers, three goals to one, and the players actually did not do well in that particular game. But right now, they are coming into the game preparing themselves very well after winning four goals to know They are really poised for action, and some players that we should expect are the, those who scored the goals for them. Yes, they had the likes of Kito who scored yesterday for them. Nelson also scored yesterday for them. Then Laukin. Laukin. He scored a brace in yesterday's encounter. He is one of their top stars who is coming into this game as he scored brace yesterday. As Mozambique will play in Group A during the turn along Algeria, the host Ethiopia and Libya. Don't forget that, you know, um, you know everything is going to go on well in this particular African Nations Championship, which is going to begin very soon in algeria now the ghana team on the other hand our captain is also back that is i'm talking of glass and awako he's also back and he is doing well even if he doesn't play in the friendly game he will go on to play in the chan tournament so that's an update coming in from there just take and stay with me for more latest news from the chan team now let's talk about Tarek Ni Lamte. He plays for Brighton Hove Albion in the EPL and over the weekend, his side did very well, winning by some five goals to one in the English FA Cup round three games. And he was fantastic. He started and ended the game for Brighton as they won that particular game at away grounds yes they started very well just scoring on the eight minutes um you know the home side actually pulled the goal back or they equalized then the likes of lalana and uh, McAllister and the other guys made sure that the game will be five goals to one for brighton and hove albion in that particular game now after the game Tariq nilamte came to twitter and officially he posted this he said big win and team performance 
on to the next round thanks for all the support that is what he wrote on his official um, account congratulating his um, players saying that they have done well and they should move on to the next one and make sure that they grab the victory in their next game so we look forward that the player will get a lot of playing minutes in the world cup we saw him playing only one match for ghana that was the game against south korea where ghana also won that game even though he had his um, you know short falls in the second half but he was a good player overall and we hope that he will get a lot of playing minutes at brighton of albion because of injuries since he moved from chelsea to brighton he had not had um you know some run or some good football minutes to be playing in there but we hope that he will take away Vertman and be playing as a right back for brighton in the upcoming games now let's move on and talk finally about kudus mohammed that i give you the shout out and we will be out of yes yes kudus mohammed also missed the game that i has played yesterday in the Eredivisie against Nick Nedjman, of which I brought you an update on this and the game ended one all as Ayas is actually you know suffering this season they are now lying on third position three points behind the league leaders find out in the Eredivisie and Kudus Mohamed did not make the squad at all yesterday and many people were talking about him why he wasn't part of the squad I brought you an update yesterday telling you that it is because he was detected with symptoms of flu there is a flu outbreak in um, Netherlands and because of that four IAS players including Mohamed Kudus were actually detected with those symptoms because of that the Kudus did not train with the team in the previous training session before the game then the game itself he wasn't part of the starting lineup then the bench as well he wasn't part of the squad at all and because of that Manchester United fans were really excited on social media citing example of Anthony Mateos before he joined Manchester United we all know he boycotted training sessions then he also boycotted um, matches because he wanted to move to Manchester United many are saying that Kudus is also on that path to join Manchester United even though residents weren't known at that time they were excited that the player will be on the way to join Manchester United but it wasn't like that it is because Kudus was actually detected with some symptoms of flu as I brought to you but hey Manchester United fans were uh, jubilating and that's an update for you on this channel shout out going out to Elijah and Asante thank you for commenting on the last video yesterday I appreciate you of course then Adepa Ama Ama Adepa thank you you were wishing Kudus Mohamed speedy recovery and um i also have kwame edu jenfi i know you are watching me from united states of america thank you for joining me kwame edu jenfi you have always been here foster maunya i appreciate you a lot foster thank you for being here justina semenyo you also congratulated Antoine semenyo you said you love him so much yes justina semenyo thank you for being here aj maxwell aj thank you i've seen you elijah nana sante it's also elijah what's up i've seen you of course Kofi Michael was also here. Kofi Michael, thank you for commenting. Adepa Ama or Ama Adepa, I've seen your comment. You are also doing well. AMT Grind Day, yes, that's the handle name I got. You also said that, yes, you wonder why Kudus wasn't part of the squad yesterday. Yes, it's because of the flu. Then I also have Gosway Eziko. Gosway, thank you for commenting. Of course, I appreciate you. Agana Richard is also here. Agana, thank you. I'm doing well. Baba Ojakai is also here. Baba Ojakai, thank you. I know all the other guys, the likes of Nia Akotodo, do come and comment. Regina Afo, come and comment. Adobia Ifi, all the other guys. I appreciate each and every one of you. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe, put on the bell, and leave your comments in the comment section. This was Kenny TV, and of course, we shall meet later.